Killing our fucking people like that. We've been uh, facing this liquid genocide that's been going against our communities and uh, whether it's in the form of alcohol or big oil corporations, uh, they've been flooding our lives and uh, destroying uh, not only uh, our, our, our livelihoods, but our whole community as a whole. And it comes from a historical uh, trauma that comes uh, uh, systemic uh, issues that come from this alcohol dealing with uh, Native American communities. And, and I know from Denver, Colorado, where I'm from, um, the Coors Brewery that has gained fame around the world uh, started out in my community uh, with the Ku Klux Klan, holding Klan rallies at the top of uh, uh, the Coors Brewery Company. And there's pictures, and you can see this history uh, of the Adolph Coors family. Uh, he was Grand Dragon of the KKK, and they wouldn't hire Chicanos uh, in the 60s. And it took a long time for uh, my uncles from the Brown Berets and my aunties from the Brown Berets of the Crusade for Justice to bring awareness to Colorado and say, Ya basta, chale con cors, uh, for us to realize that um, these corporations were against us even in the big city, not just on the reservations. And so uh, I'm proud to walk behind the pass of Russell Means, who led the charge in White Clay, and now Aloha Martinez, who picks up that. Uh, that leadership to go up and, and, and change things in white clay for the next seven generations of our, uh, of our children's future. Um, so thank you. Uh, alcohol justice has brought us a voice uh, and an extra power and force um, to fighting the, this problem in, in Nebraska. And so thank you. Uh, from the bottom of our hearts, uh, from across Turtle Island, uh, aho from all the warriors, uh, much blessings. Thank you. Mitakiapi.